Hey, what it is, what's up? Welcome to another day of accountability. So, yeah, I just came from the gym. time well from the morning actually now that i think about it so from that point in time i figured i was like damn son what's wrong what is wrong by you feel me obviously the certain elements where i said yeah son these are not you know what they're going to do they're going to be about to feel types of ways that's natural you're not going to be Why is it like this? You feel me? And then obviously I had to do some math and be like, nah, actually, considering the considering a full view of what's going on, I'm actually blessed. And I'd rather be in this position than the position that I was in a couple of months ago. You feel me? Alright, cool, grand. But you know what it is. Emotions travel faster than thoughts. So I figured that, okay, cool. Don't act out of panic. Don't do anything drastic. Rather, just chill. You feel me? Chill and get into the right state of mind so that at least, at least, <laughs> when need be, I can address things appropriately and move in the correct direction so that i'm not just on an emotional um what's this yeah i'm on an emotional rendezvous and yeah one thing that i figured is that there's a point in time where i was on the couch and i was like if i were to visualize it or paint a picture this angst has definitely has a feeling but sometimes it's best to be conscious of the hey, feeling a lot of people and understand where it's safe. And it's like a different type of pressure you feel a different type of pressure that's like, you know at the same time my heart and i found that you know what i can just take it off and be lighter but nonetheless i was like hey it is what it is up here you know, I keep on checking if the gym is open, it isn't, and I was like, damn, I might not go to the gym or so things up. And I told myself, no ways, bro. You see, this is when things go south. This is how things go south. So the best thing to do, obvious, like I always say, focus on devotion, focus on meditation, focus on breathing, understanding what is going on. Alright, it's cool. Considering that shit, progression is never really just. Next time I try, I'm trying to push sand. Progression is not just about. It's a bad thing. Unless it's about your thing. It's a realistic nature of life. Nah, I was like, let me just adjust it. As we move forward, right? There's going to be goods and bads. You feel me? And I guess that is just the natural balance of life. Unfortunately, there is as much good as there is bad, but I feel like both have utility. Both definitely have utility, but as to how one can utilize such, hey man, that's a personal endeavor, that's a personal thought process and understanding of what it is that you can gain or what it is that you can do in order to make sure that things make sense. You know, and there's a lot to grow from. There's a lot, you know, negative situations help people grow more often than not when allowed, when embraced. Let me say that. And yeah, that's where I'm at. Actually, yeah, finding a way to embrace it and making it make sense in the grand scheme of things and understanding that just because there's 10% bad doesn't mean that 100% is bad, you know? And also feeling like that, you know, it's different knowing that you're blessed versus feeling like you're blessed. 
because you can be blessed and see it but feeling it different and it's important i feel like to always put in that extra effort to feel it and be like damn i'm blessed but nonetheless i hit the gym you feel me did the basics i had cool strapless beltless my back is hurting now it's not that cute type of pain it's the type of pain that's concerning it's like oh my spine hurts a bit on the right so yeah but i'm just gonna build up my stamina as well because resting for two minutes between each set or three minutes damn son that's a bit of a rough one hey i need to build up my stamina but that's neither here nor there build up my stamina you know build up my strength also build up my form and my back because i noticed that hey man when i put this the what's this the belt on and squat yeah i can go further than i should right with crappy form but when i don't have a belt on and this crappy form key different story i guess one thing that i notice is that because i am at an advanced point in time of my lifts if i'm not mistaken i noticed that everything else with life is getting to an advanced stage it isn't elite you feel me and there's levels to being advanced you get me because squatting 179 versus squatting 185 190 200 are different things you feel me i don't know where the boundary of elite is at this body weight but nonetheless you feel me it's a journey and i've noticed that yeah everything has come to this point in time of somewhat being uncomfortable so the best thing that i could do is to embrace the discomfort embrace the suckitude of how things suck you feel me and just put in more effort into building a stronger foundation for example with gymming building up more stamina have to do cardio probably eat healthier probably even sleep more be more consistent you know with my current life circumstance and that's fine same thing goes with work now it's time to deepen my knowledge not have digital marketing skills and sales skills as a solo entrepreneur no but as an employee in a company that is a different ball game you feel me because on one end it's a touch and go on the other end you need to perform and get everything done so i guess my life is at that point in time of just being like yo i need to put in more work than i did in order to progress more than i will and at this point i'm more than i did in order to get at this point so yeah it's it's quite an interesting lesson and hopefully i remember this but hey that's that besides for that thanks for watching have a great day